We are in World Casual Conference 2023. It is happening in Dubai. And with me today, we have Mr. Bandar Okrin. He is from Al Jamil International. So tell us about your business. What do you do? We are Al Jamil International Company, based in Saudi Arabia, in Dubai, in Kuwait, and in Turkey. We are mainly doing our businesses: uh, nuts, spices, pulses, cardamom, coffee, and we have halva and tahina sesame big factory. And so we have a beverage. Okay. Uh, our brands is Kinza and Lift Up is the new brands. Okay. What we are doing in cashew we, and uh, walnuts and uh, almonds, pistachio. We have a factory, factory. We have a cracking factory for nuts here in uh, Dubai. Okay. And we have roasting factory will be start next month in uh, Jeddah in Saudi Arabia. Our capacity in Saudi Arabia for uh, nuts in the factory will be eight ton per hour. Eight ton per hour. Yes, that's a that very good be, number. It is. That I think is is largest factory in uh, Saudi Arabia. We are in Saudi Arabia. We have uh, around 30 to 35 percent market share from the nuts, okay. in cashew, walnuts, uh, pistachio, and almonds. Between Saudi Arabia and Dubai, we do around 6,500 ton cashew per year. That means if we uh, consider on our same business, that is so much, so uh, much it is. Yes, uh, I think we are the market leader. Yes. Is what is your business like export or domestic supply? What do you do? Uh, that is different between Saudi Arabia and Dubai. In Dubai, we import the cashew, sell in local market and re-export. Okay. Okay. And Saudi Arabia is different. We import the cashew, we sell to manufacturing, we sell to all channels. I have 24,000 customers. That's in Saudi fantastic, Arabia. Fantastic number yes. it is. 200 distribution van or uh, trucks wow, wow, and wow. 200 salesmen. We have in Saudi Arabia around 850 employees. Very nice. When you're talking about roasted, whatever you're handling, for example, 6,500 tons, it is completely going for roasted or only certain proportion? No. We still not start roasting in Saudi. We will start next month. We are trying to move do some transformation in the roasting. Now what happened in Saudi Arabia and before? Who's lead the market? The traders. Traders mainly looking only for a buy and sell. Not look to transfer, do any transformation in the idea of the consumption. What we are targeting to do some transformation in the nuts from traditional way to modern way from the traditional in roasting, what they are roasting now, 60% in the market. Roasting, cashew, walnuts, in same areas, grinding the spices. So you, you never test the cashew as well in cashew. Yes, 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 and yes, not yes. packed with nitrogen. It's not also stock it or put it in warehouse in, in the good way. So we are targeting now, we are all our new facility, hygienic. Okay, very high standard and top. We need to roast good roasting, standard roasting, and give to supermarket, key account, uh, modern trade, traditional trade, wholesale, as standard quality, as standard flavors, and nitrogen, more shelf life. Okay, that will help the consumers to buy again and again and again exactly. and like it the quality, like it the test what they I buy and give money for that. Your experience about this conference, how the network happened, what's your views? Good things happen. Uh, to be honest, is also need to develop the, these organizations more and more. We need to see him speak with consumers, direct social media and all of channel to Tell the consumer why to eat cashew. Why cashew, not walnuts? I like to tell you one thing. Recently, I think November 23rd was International Cashew Day, right? Yeah. So that time, what our company did was in India, uh, we actually circulated free cashew to the public, to everyone, whoever is on the road, whoever is walking, whoever is in office, especially for the women. And uh, we have collected their uh, testimonial videos, their thoughts about cashew why they are thinking it is healthy. That is uploaded in our website, cashewishealthy.com. There is a website. This is only for awareness. It's good. And Saudi Arabia, or not only Saudi Arabia, on all this region, people is eating the cashew as tasting snacks. We need to show the value of this product to the consumer. So it is need a lot of things. 
in university communication between the World Cashew and university, between World Cashew and other programs in, uh, in the region, and social media, especially create social media in Arabic, yeah. okay? Arabic social media, especially for Cashew and Saudi Arabia. Yeah. Uh, so we can support that. Sure, we can support that. See, that's a fantastic suggestion. We will take ahead. Well, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you.